name is Ryan Warnberg and I'm one of the coaches here at Zap Fitness and we're going to go over um, our core and strength routine here at Zap that we do with our elite athletes. The first thing that we do, we kind of start every core set with the same thing and it's just a simple single leg balance routine where um, as a beginner you'll start just standing on the ground, flat ground with one foot. And the idea here is to maintain proper body position, good posture through your spine, um, keeping your shoulders over your hips and your hips over your feet so everything is in a good place posturally. And what we'll do, as you'll see these guys, is simply just stand on one foot and then um, we'll take about 30 seconds and challenge yourself with some arm movements. Um, and then as they become more advanced with this, uh, you can do it with your eyes closed, which adds an extra element of stability that's required in the exercise. And then as you progress from there, you can even introduce something that challenges the stability of your foot on the ground, something like a BOSU ball or um, even one of those foam pads that makes it a little bit harder for your foot to balance on the ground. So um, you can go ahead and jump on there if you want. But, um, and again, you'll do the same routine, even with something where you lack stability like the BOSU ball, where we'll stand on there, again, really thinking about maintaining good posi position, keeping your core muscles engaged to support that posture. And then you can even introduce some, some arm movements with this as you uh, continue to advance with the exercise. And again, we do it for about 30 seconds at a time um, on each leg. We'll do it a couple of times and we'll do that at the beginning and at the end of each one of our sets. Um, again, just to kind of reiterate the fact that you know, as a runner, you're always on one foot at a time. So we really want to get good at balancing and strengthening the lower part of the leg um, so that we have proper position when you're not really able to think about it when you're running. It's something that you're not thinking about consciously. And here we are. So we're really able to challenge ourselves by focusing on it a little bit so that when you get to the running races or even, you know, just training, you're able to do it a little bit more on an unconscious level.